Hello, today we're at 3814 Santiago Street. This is in Virginia Park in beautiful South Tampa. And this home is a three bedroom, three bath, over 2,500 square foot of living space in the house itself. And over another 500 square feet of living space in the in-law suite, so over 3,000 square feet of living space. Right now we're just having a scan around the neighborhood and Virginia Park is in a A-plus school district. The schools here are Del Mabry Elementary, Coleman Middle School, Plant High School. Let's go and have a look inside. As we walk up to the house, over here on the left side of the house you can see the parking pad. There's enough room for four cars to park. There's also additional street parking. Now you enter this home into a formal living room and you can see the beautiful oak hardwood floors. This house was built in 1938 and they certainly know, knew how to do beautiful floors in 1938. The formal living room is a very generously sized formal dining room. And off to the right here, you have immediate access to the kitchen. Up ahead, you see stairs that lead to the second floor. This is a split bedroom plan. Two of the bedrooms are on the first floor. And we're going to start off looking at the two bedrooms. A lot of storage space in this particular bedroom. It's very good size. And this bedroom has its own ensuite bathroom. Double sinks, toilet and a step-in shower. The second bathroom in the house is one of my favorite because it has many of the original touches. Here's the original floor tile from the 1930s. The baseboards look, are original, the wooden windows are, even the cast iron tub. They don't make tubs like those anymore, that's for sure. And this tub has a shower. The third bedroom accesses that full bathroom. Go into the kitchen next, and I'm going to slide all the way over here to have a look back. Now, the kitchen features ceramic tile flooring, granite countertops, nice quality Bosch stainless steel dishwasher, undermount sink, gas, kitchen A, top of the line kitchen aid range, an over range microwave hood. This pantry, there's plenty of storage in here as you can see there. The pantry has slide out shelves. Refrigerator has one of my favorite features, the, the freezer that slides out from the bottom. And behind here is a really cool feature of the 1938 home. It has a built-in table and two benches that pop out from there. And there's a photograph on the website if you want to see that. Off the back of the kitchen, we have a generously sized family room. And there is a pass-through 
into the family room from the kitchen. Before we go upstairs, let's go outside. So we're now out in the backyard and to orient you, we have a heated swimming pool and spa, an outdoor cabana deck area with dine, dining and an outdoor kitchen. Here is the in-law suite. Nice pavers here and and there is a generously sized side yard as well, not bad. And out through the white picket fence you have access to parking. We'll have a closer look at the cabana and outdoor kitchen. Now the green egg does convey in the sail. Go inside the in-law suite. And this is over 500 square feet under central heat and air. It's under its own system. So Tio tile floor, there is a full kitchen. And a full bath. For a total of six bath, oh, sorry, four bathrooms in the house. This has a step-in shower. We'll go upstairs now. Through the family room. Now, now under the stairs, there is a generously sized laundry room, takes side by side full size washer and dryer and there's also a study office area let's go upstairs and you can see very nice oak hardwood treads here on the stairs Now the air conditioning is split zone, meaning that the upstairs here is separate from the first floor, which is separate from the in-law suite. So three separately controllable systems can help you be very energy efficient. Nice vaulted ceilings in this master bedroom, some plant shelves up there. And there are two closets. The first one is up these stairs. The second closet is in the master bathroom. And the master bathroom is very nice. Custom cabinetry, granite countertops double sinks. It's a walk-in closet. And the master bathroom has perhaps my favorite feature in this house, the spectacular 18 foot high step-in shower. It has the rain shower head, these are body jets, there's another shower head over here, a very large luxurious shower. That is the linen closet. If this house interests you, please contact us or your agent and we'll be happy to arrange a showing.